Good morning, my loving YouTube family. I hope you guys are doing amazing. I'm in my morning routine now. Um, I have some coffee here. This is like where I like to put my coffee. Um, wow, my relationship to coffee, it has changed completely because um, during my healing journey, I would only have like a tiny drop of coffee because I did some research how supposedly um, coffee is not that great for you but then there's research that it is I don't know and um, back then right a few months ago when I would have coffee I would only have it with um, without sugar <laughs> but now I do add a little sugar um, but yeah this is my morning cup of coffee and um, I usually have one yeah, I usually have one, um, but if I have a very long day and then that particular day I'm very tired, then um, I will have, I might have a little more, you know? I don't want to say well because I don't want to put it into like an existence, right? I'm like, might, might have a little more. Um, but yeah, guys, I just wanted to get on here real quick, have a chat with you guys, um, give you guys some sort of an update. I know you guys have asked me questions and I'm like, have I answered all of them? You know, any questions you guys have about, you know, this cancer healing journey, which has been insane, always uh, please feel free to put it down in the comment section and um, I'll try to answer them. Trying to balance it all, the, the, the classroom life, all my responsibilities and like, you know, the videos, but yeah, I want to keep on... Um, doing the videos here with you all and you know ma making them better giving you guys what you guys asked for you know um i still have to do a tea video i did see that comment um which is gonna be like super simple it's like the simplest way that i make tea well one of the teas that i make right um but yeah guys happy wednesday i hope you guys are having the most beautiful beautiful wednesday midweek wake up be present you know and let's not let life pass us by because with our routines life seems like it can go quickly and if we don't stop for a second and think then um before you know it like life is like you know oh that's it like we are at the end of you know the month or we're at the end of 2024 20, what did i do right so what things that we want for our life whatever we want for our life we need to plan that and schedule that in into our daily routine right make steps towards that like it doesn't have to be a giant step it could be a small one or you know however you guys may feel about that you know maybe one day is smaller maybe one day is bigger you know however uh, but yeah guys um I haven't done a live in a long time, you know, that'll be nice. Maybe do a live again and um, yeah. Uh, what did I do this morning for my health routine? I drank water as usual, I had my supplements, I had my large cup of celery juice and I had um, carrot juice as well and now um, I'm gonna have some coffee. Yesterday, I did have a bagel for the first time in a while. I don't know if I told you guys. For the first time in a while in the morning. This morning, I'm not. And as usual, every morning, I do not have food. I only have liquid because I want my body to be in a fasted state. And coffee, you can have coffee to be in a fasted state. The only thing I have to check is that I think you may not be able to add sugar to not um you may not be able to add sugar to continue to be in a fasted state you know i need to double check that but i think and um yeah my friend always tells me oh you don't want to activate your liver um you know you want to be on keto friendly foods but yeah i like to be on liquids in the morning and just be in that fasted state and then maybe like at 12 o'clock then i'll eat something close to one o'clock um yeah and as far as blood work i'm scheduled for blood work this friday um 
so yeah guys let's see how that goes um i have been eating a little bit more carbs and i have added a little more sugar in my diet but um you know not like i added it permanently i just like if i feel like eating something then i'll eat it but um obviously i'm watching what i eat i'm int intentional with what i eat and um i am mindful of what i eat and uh try to eat i say try right no one's perfect <laughs> like healthy things as much as possible every day you know but yeah guys um you know, let's stay positive. It's going to be good, God willing. And let's keep moving forward, working towards what we want. I had to tell you guys that, um, you know, um, I'm going to go now. Oh, my God. Um, that for this year, 2024, when we had the whole countdown and everything and, like, that holiday season, I felt different because... You know, the previous year, all I wanted was like, God, please give me back my health. I want to be here longer with my girls, my family. And then this year when, you know, the fact that I'm no evidence of disease since August, late August, I'm like, wow, what is my resolution? Like, what do I ask for? What do I want next? Like, what else do I want to do with my life? I'm like, I, I get another another opportunity at, to do what I want, right? Or to do, or to discover new things too. So it's been a big like realization for me and I've had a lot of epiphanies that maybe I'll share with you guys some other ones like relationship wise, right? I'm a single mom, I have two girls and um, on a different time, I'll share that with you guys, some relationship epiphanies I've had, but you know regarding resolutions that's how i felt and i'm like this feels different i'm like wow i can actually feel like i want to plan more things other than just my health you know because obviously health is my priority my health my my routine my workouts and of course like sharing all this information with you guys and and helping people right get healthy but yeah guys i love you very much I can talk to you forever. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.